There's the bell, and here we go. We're all along for the ride on this one, but make no mistake about it, we're going to have a winner. That wild strike found nothing but empty air that time. <laughs> Man, that's what you call swinging for the fences and missing. Thinking to avoid that. Not today, too fast. What you take and what Stardust has been going through. In the spring of 2014, Cody Rhodes reached a critical point in his life and his career. The man we knew disappeared and we were introduced to Stardust, someone whose life remains a mystery to this day. The man known as Cody Rhodes by his own admission is dead. Stardust insists he's from a place called the Fifth Dimension and keeps everyone, including himself, shall we say, off balance. Definitely looking confident in this one-on-one -on -one environment. That's a good sign. Another amazing singles contest. These two never cease to entertain the WWE Universe. Some claim Stardust is the product of an identity crisis. That may be accurate, but one thing you cannot question is the success. Stardust has been one half of the WWE Tag Team Champions and a contender for many of WWE's prestigious championships. I'm having a hard time figuring out what they're going to do next. Me too. I've given up even trying to figure out what they're going to do next. I'm just sitting back watching and enjoying. Look at these two giving it their all. There's absolutely no quit in them tonight. Stardust is so far out there that he talks about the DNA and molecules in the human body being connected to stars in the sky. I mean, he formed a championship team with his brother Goldust and amazes wherever he goes. Oh, a huge slam. Good grief. How is he still conscious? Look past the ring at the thousands and thousands of WWE fans in attendance. Each and every one of them are having a great time tonight. Oh, you're right about that. You always have a great time when you attend the WWE event live. Just like we are here tonight, this is wonderful. Ow, ooh, he is just getting busted up. has really gained some ground here with his offense. Good grief! How is he still conscious? Boy, there's no way he's going to be able to stick. Watch out! Oh, that was a thing of beauty! Just amazing! Woo, a little showboating going on here. He's simply reminding him that he's here. Thinking to avoid that. Not today, too fast. When he gets going like this, there are a few better. How much damage did that do? A lot from the looks of it. Once Stardust hooks the leg and goes for the dark. It's just a matter of time now. Well, uh, going to the top. High risk. Oh, they're taking a risk here. That's how you win matches. I mean, there is nothing like seeing somebody go flying through the air. Warm up the buses. This one's over. Now that's the type of move that sends a message to an opponent. Yeah, and that's a message you don't want to receive. Oh, out of nowhere! He's showing no signs of letting up. 
Stardust is totally vulnerable at this point. Uh-oh. I think that really hurt his arm. Not a lot of spring left in his step right now. We're looking at complete domination here. At this point, you have to figure that the next person to apply a submission will win. Well, that's what I'm thinking. Let's see who it's going to be. Look how slow he is to recover here. That was some serious punishment. He doesn't want to do this outside the ring. Well, I don't blame him. Keep the action inside the ring. That's where you're going to win this thing. Man, talk about putting a target on someone's back. Oh, man, how do you stand after an attack like this? I'd like to take a moment right now to wish everybody watching a very Merry Christmas. Thank you for spending part of your holiday with us. Great counter. Quick thinking to avoid that. You could call this a good old-fashioned butt whooping. Yeah, that's exactly what we're witnessing. A butt whooping. Not today, too fast. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Stardust has dropped hard. Offense like this is exactly how a competitor takes control of a match. It's the way I always used to do it. Wow, that was a wild strike. Talk about missing the target. Yeah, it looked like it was completely out of desperation. This one's not over yet. We've seen plenty of people come back from being in a lot worse shape. That strike hit the spot. There's no way he could have avoided that blow. The arm seems to have a target on it. Yeah, like a big red bullseye. Oh, out here you have to be able to think on your feet lightning fast. One mistake, one moment of hesitation, and you can find yourself in a world of hurt. circulation to the brain. You could pass out from a hold like that. These competitors trying to keep their wits about them. Well, Cole, it's so important not to lose your cool in a match like this, not to lose your focus. You make a mistake, and I guarantee you, your opponent is going to capitalize on it. Boy, he is really tired now. That tank of his has to be reading empty. It has to be, King. But I still don't see him giving up. He's pulling out all the stops tonight. Well, we're on the move here. The arm seems to have a target on it. Yeah, like a big red bullseye. I'm not sure I can watch this. is now bleeding. Well, clearly not afraid to stick with a good thing here, right, Cole? Even ain't broke. Well, don't fix it. The repetition on that move is becoming deliberate at this point. Oh, out here you have to be able to think on your feet lightning fast. One mistake, one moment of hesitation, and you can find yourself in a world of hurt. to avoid that extra slow getting back to his base here 